Hey, what up, homies? It's your man, it's Coach Meadow. We coming to you live from our PS3. This is week three. I believe this is episode three of season six of the UNT Dynasty. Thank you guys for coming back. Um, I'm having a lot of fun with this. We're trying to defend the ship. And week one, you know, we went out and we took on Army at Army. Army, they were unranked, but they're going to be ranked at the end of the season. I was a very good team. It's not your mom and dad's Army, though. Man, they straight up... Almost 500 yards passing on us, honestly. Like they were slinging the ball all over the all over the field. They have an air raid uh, coach. They went to the air raid. They recruited air raid players, and now they're tough. Last week, Clemson, number one team in the country. I wouldn't say we handled them, but the defense stepped up. Offense did what it could. Took advantage of uh, some, uh, a couple of uh, turnovers, some good field position. We're able to get the dub this week. We got SMU. It's a rivalry of sorts, even though. They haven't beaten us. Just is what it is. Uh, this year's iteration, just gonna be honest with you, they're gonna have a really, really tough time with us. They just, they don't have the horses uh, as well as they've, uh, their offense has played so far this year, averaging 52 uh, points a game. I don't think they're putting 52 on us. I just, I, I don't see it. I don't see it. Neither team comes into the game with injuries. We have two very impressive wins. I look at how SMU has played. They beat Duke. I'm trying to figure out how they're only averaging 52 points a game. If Oh, they lost. I can't read. <laughs> yeah, so they're coming off an overtime loss last week to Duke. Yeah. <laughs> um, up to this point, our statistical leaders, of course, Vincent Galloway. He's those four interceptions in the first game. Those were all in the first game. We'll see how long that trend lasts. Orton's our lead in Russia, but we have a plethora like we have five six guys who touch the ball a game and of course our featured receiver sean goss 136 yards a game uh three touchdowns already he's just playing really really well the defense as you see leading tackler is freshman free safety chris carter and um yeah that's pretty much it smu it uh, i don't know how they scored 52 points <laughs> i mean I see what the running back did, but hey, man, hey, we'll, we'll see. Uh, good luck to them, but I don't see them being much of a challenge. Now, team building. Uh, we've kind of shifted from a team who kind of takes uh, what, what what we can get to a team. Now, now we can start focusing on certain players, and this year, it's a lot of these... Uh, I call them the 90-90-90 the guys. Like, obviously, we're going to recruit offensive line, defensive line. But these guys like Jonathan Noel, uh, basically 90-90-90. Um, I'm, I'm expecting him to play defense, but he could be a potential quarterback for us. These two, Zach Weiss, Clay Mills, they're both of that, you know, the the the, the little guy ilk. Like, this uh, Wise is more of the Percy Harvin and Clay Mills is more of your DeAnthony Thomas type. He's the small guy, good speed, good you know juke move in the open field. He's going to be a problem. We haven't had this type of guy. We've got one on our roster right now. It was a, he's, a, he's a junior from a, a JC Collins, but he's not. He's pretty much capped out. Like he'll probably cap out in the 80s. We're looking at these true freshmen who can really come in and just by being on the field cause problems for the defense. And then defensively, we're, 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 we're aiming at big safeties, big linebackers. Like, I want the 6'4", 220, 230-pound guy, long, athletic, can uh, cover a lot of space. And up front, we're looking at just 330-pound guys who take up space and force the offense to double-team them. So that's pretty much what we're doing team build-wise. Uh, so far, we only got one commit. Willie Thornton, that goes along with our, our tight ends. And a uh, fullback focus, because we're really trying to shore up those those uh, positions where you don't get them every year. So you just kind of got to go recruit them when you need them. And uh, we're hopefully going to get two fullbacks. I want two fullbacks and four tight ends, but we'll see. So, yeah, that's what's going on, man. Let's get on to this SMU game, and hopefully we handle business, and this isn't very entertaining. <laughs> In 2011, one of the major selling points to students throughout the stadium fee campaign was construction of 21 luxury suites. We'll just see. 
Okay. Oh, why did he catch the ball like that? <laughs> why did he? He caught the ball. I, I let him, and he just caught the ball standing still. That was dumb. I kept showing cover two, so let me let me put cover four out there now. Put these guys outside the hash. Okay. Almost, almost. That would have been six too, because McDougal can fly. That would have been six. McDougal can fly. Oh, they ran the draw. And we gave up the cheeks. We gave up the cheeks to S. Oh my God! What the hell? We gave up the cheeks. Okay. He's under pressure. Wow! Wow! What? Touchdown, Mustangs! There are times on this game where I'm just like, "What the hell?" <laughs> Yeah, run that route because I've seen that route develop before. Oh no. Galloway, he really wanted to throw a pick on that play. He really wanted to throw a pick. Okay, we're struggling with SMU. That's what we're doing. Actually, just in case they run that smash concept. Okay. Oh, it's. What? <laughs> what? Okay. I love. I, I like Syria. You know, Syria. Five wide. Ah. Uh, I don't know what this could be. I'm gonna have to. Okay. Once again, they beat Brown. I didn't help Brown. Actually, I think it's going to be coming from that receiver. Yeah. And he throws it away. Yeah, we were squatting on that. We were squatting on that. Spotlighting. Get that in your life, bro. Oh, my God. Hawkins, you're done. You're done, Hawkins. You're done. That's... Wow. By the defense line there. They dominated the point of attack. You're done, Hawkins. You you're you're out of those. Jesus, bro. We got stopped three times in a row. None of them have been because of what their defense is doing. Smash. Okay. Zone read. There we go. Trying to be cute. Trying to be cute. Didn't want to just meet me in the hole. Every team in the country. They gave us cover two. What? I don't understand why they play cover two. If they're not, gonna, they're not, they don't play it right. Like you, you, you throw cover two at me. If you don't have a guy, if you don't have a guy who can cover that space, don't play cover two. We're still gonna bring them. They come out on an empty backfield. None of that. There'll be none of that. I wanted a bigger hit, but we were there. He felt this. Keep they keep giving me this look, and so we we have to take advantage of it. Oh. Uh oh, hit the seam. Bye bye. Bye bye. Somebody got. Somebody put hands on 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 a on a SMU DB. <laughs> I saw hands. Hold on, who? Somebody got those hands on that play, man. Oh no, we can't let that happen. Oh no. All right, and then I will worry about what's going on on the right side. Oh, uh -huh. you're doing this. You're gonna try me. And they got to him before he could get back to the You're gonna try. You can't try the foot speed. Cause had he pitched it, I would have. Oh man, I was about to line him up like a barber, bro. Stick. Oh no. Yo, he was about. He also. Triplet was about to put all kinds of hands on that man if he'd have caught it. 
Right. They're showing me that I can work that, but I like what's going on inside here. Forward lean. Let's get a little forward lean going. A little, little flight of the bumblebee. A little flight of the bumblebee. All right, bubble. Too high structure. Okay. North Texas holds a four-point lead. Is this quarters or cover two? You know what? It might be quarters. So. Okay, it's quarters. We're just gonna take a shot. We're just gonna throw it out there. We're just gonna throw it out there. So if you don't know, when they play quarters and they come up like that, if they don't have the speed to run with your guy and there's no bump, give it a little time. Take a forward step and just throw that thing. Just, just throw that thing. Smash on the left. He came inside, so where's this I'm next threat? Going deep, oh no, go get it, Tyler. There. Go get it, Tyler. Jake. Ma. Yeah. All right, so if that quarterback that were more talented time. and had the arm to throw that out or his receiver was better, that's probably a touchdown, but he didn't. Okay. Uh, Jackson, can you just run by that guy? <clears throat> just throw it out a little bit. I know they have none of their matchups. Can they run with us? With our three guys outside. So if I identify it. And I have Tom. That's six. They better go back to backing up. And keeping those safeties way back. And yeah, we'll send it from the running backs from that side. So we'll probably get one last heave to the end zone here before halftime. He wants it all. Did we? Oh my God. Oh my God. He's tackled. All right, so we're never playing the zone version of that again because the zones just did not keep dropping. I should have had two people. It was just Jake versus the world. <laughs> we're going to sit. We're going to sit on that smash. Oh, wow. Good. Man. Uh, triplet. Triplet absolutely took out Jake. And then I can't be mad at Jake, though, because Jake's not a press corner, apparently. You here. If the slant comes, I'm... Oh, my God. I have no faith in, in Jake Tyler. I have so little faith in that man. Who ran it? Yo, Collins? Shout out to Collins. Yo, lit. Droid right now. Okay, I'm sitting on this. Oh no, I was in a... I did what the computer does. I didn't get out on the uh, on the out route. But now we're gonna find out for no, on the hash. See, you see how much better Pearson played it. Jake, I'm gonna need you to grow up, bro. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Who we are learning is no stud. I have to protect against the slant if it's stick. Not stick. Oh wow! And they hook up on that one. that looked like a touchdown. To if they outside. if they look at it, that's a touchdown. I'm pass committing. I'm lurking in the middle. I'm on this. Ooh. Okay, Jake. This Good tackle. I like running the counter to... Oh, man. Why did they give me that front when I called the counter? Yeah. I saw you. I saw you. 
I saw you running that alley. I saw that. And you got your jock strap. Uh, give me that. 51, give me that jock. Uh, uh, pause? Do I have to say pause? Empty backfield. Okay. Everybody just left them. Dudes just left their zones. This is all very annoying. This is all very annoying. Russell Schroeder again. You know what? Let's just... This could be cover two. Let's just, let's just take a look. Let's see. Man, okay. I was not ready for man. But I've, I know my options. I know my options. Hmm. This, this looks really promising, especially if they make us pitch. Okay. I'm going to get to pitch. Yeah. The, the corner... When he, I think he was at like five and one. So I knew it wasn't. He, I knew he wasn't hard playing the flat, which he might have came up and made a play. But yeah, that looked promising. All right, once again, we're gonna, we, we just want to make that pocket like. He's scrambling. down. So we can't pass rush him. We take the. We take a uh, our spy. Let's try something else. Coming here. And actually. With five wide receivers. Oh, it's Verts. It's Verts. It I'm on this. Missed him. Carter did not make a play on the ball, but I was, was there. Fundamental pass defense. So they definitely weren't going to complete it. All right. Down. From the field. Yeah. Around the 36 yard line. Well, it's a good job at a quarterback of recognizing the blitz and getting the ball out of his hands for a first down. Second and two, you know what it do. Where's my fullback? Yeah. Get this big body in there. Deal with this thick young man. 270, 280 pounds coming downhill. He fights forward to about the 46. Corey Dykes. There you go. Okay. Okay. Good blocks. Got a shed on our tackle. We kind of expected that, though. He's apparently lost that matchup. He was giving us red vibes. <laughs> uh... Yeah, that, that, hopefully that didn't get us canceled. But Justin I mean, this is actually that's right just his last name, and he's a thick. Yeah, he's a thick one, ref. Nice run and a score by the halfback, and a nice call by the coach there. Just give it to your main man anytime you're near the goal line. Just under two to go in the game. Okay, I'm here. Jake. Uh, I'm not sure if I can be mad about that though. He he eventually was there. I was I was not expecting this. Oh my God! Fullback dive. I'm so annoyed. We are so inconsistent defensively. Because the last thing that we should have that should have happened with that many DBs on the field is us be outrun by a fullback. Oh my, Jesus! Ah, uh, that's it's disgusting. I'm gonna put Galloway in danger. Oh, oh Christ! to slide. You talk about a dual threat guy. That worked. Okay. In the air or on the ground. SMU. One more first down officially puts it in the books. We're running ISO. I shouldn't run it to this side. Our left tackle's already shown me that he's gonna. Yeah, he's in the red. 
and he's gonna be one on one. Yo. Poor business decision, two three. The Crosby. Hope I don't like our numbers over there though. Kinda got no choice. Okay. Mmm. He just falls forward. Just falls forward. I like handing 200. I want you guys to see this. I want you to see this. I want you to see why I'm giving him the ball. This guy's a bowling ball, not a bowling pin. He's a bowling ball. Hold on, wrong one. 5'11, 275 pounds. He's probably bow legged too. First and ten. Our Ball university has class. than seeing the opposing quarterback take a knee. Nice job, guys. So that wraps things up for us. I didn't like that. I didn't like that at all. I, I, I am very opposite of happy right now. I mean, we won. We were we were supposed to win. That, I mean, that ultimately, that's, mo that's the most important thing, but... Playing poorly, especially defensively and offensively to an extent. Like, we, we put up numbers, but defensively, we just... Jake got exposed a lot. Uh, our pass rush, which we knew. We knew it wasn't going to be the same. Um, our efficiency is what's really carrying us. Our, our ability to, you know, generally not turn over the ball generally convert third downs generally get off the field on third down you know and if and if we're not necessarily getting a bunch of first downs it's because we're getting a bunch of big plays that are it's just minim, minimizing the opportunities uh galloway heisman trophy performance again over 200 passing some touchdowns over 100 rushing some touchdowns doghouse dog house right now not dog house we're, we're we're gonna give collins a chance to be the one guy who has the speed that we don't generally get out of our backfield um of course goss did his thing uh jackson he, he's, he's always a threat ryan kind of ryan and foster kind of get in where they fit in but oh man i i didn't like that at all i expected maybe 48 zero and we gave up 34 points on a lot of big plays. It just 71%, no sacks. Just, oh boy, oh boy. The drawing board, we need markers, pen. We need all the extra stuff because it this was not good. But we won. Uh, we, we we win the battle of I-35. And it's, it's a rivalry, you know, it's college football. They're kids, man, they're inconsistent. Play great against Clemson, number one team in the country. Come back home, we see SMU on the schedule. I even, hey, I, even in the pregame, I'm like, yo, we're going to bust these guys' hit. So, you know, it, it just, man, college football, bro, I tell you. But uh, thank you for watching. Um, like the video, please. Didn't cost you a thing. Comment. I generally comment back. I'm not Hollywood yet. Share the video wherever you think people will also watch the video and sub if you're watching but you're not sub but you, you dig the content or you got other ideas for other content you'd like to see i'm actually surprised yo generally receivers have like three or four pancakes against us i don't know what it is <laughs> but uh yeah all those things thank you for watching and i will sub Me. Shout out to Pride by Katana for most of the music I use in the vids. Be sure to follow on social media. I follow back. Links to all that info in the description. For more content, be sure to subscribe and click one of the links at the end of the video for more videos. Please continue to watch, like, share, and repeat. Thank you.